Binge watch and learn on TRS Clips. This is a great point to bring up the subject of astrology. It's something that I'm naturally drawn towards. Not for myself. I actually don't wish to know too much about my own future or past or karmas. Because I've learned that the process of prayer and meditation, at least to some degree, erases the effects of astrology. BK Shivani was on the show. And she said that the beginning of your life is a great representation of where your karma stand in terms of your astrological charts. As you grow older, even as you're a teenager, you're accumulating karmas, good, bad. As you grow into your professional life, you're accumulating a higher degree of good or bad karmas. Mm. As you grow older and interact with people, there's an even higher degree of karmas. Correct. So your astrological chart does change throughout your life. There is some amount of accuracy in it. And then there is some amount of moldability. What's your take on astrology in general? Yeah. See, the Vedic tradition in the body of knowledge of the Vedas, there are the four Vedas, Rig, Sam, Yajur, Atharva. Then there are the Upanishads. Then there are the Puranas, which are the case studies. And there are the Itihasas. The difference between Purana and Itihas is Ramayana and Mahabharat were written when Ram was still performing his pastimes. When Krishna was and the Pandavas were still there. So, apart from that, there is a section which is known as Vedangas. So, part of the Vedangas is Ayurveda, Vyakaran, Nyaya, Chanda, and Jyotish. So, all these are elements of knowledge to help a person improve the quality of his life. Because as per the Vedic paradigm, what is the purpose of life? The purpose of life is to fulfill your desire while remaining focused on remembering that death is only an opportunity to go back. So therefore, life is a preparation, death is an examination. So all the Vedic literatures are like a syllabus which, are, which is preparing you to have the right kind of facilities because if your body is not healthy, then you cannot do your meditation properly. You will be distracted. So therefore, Ayurveda. Right? If you want to study the literatures properly, you need the Nirukti, you need the Chanda, you need the Vyakarana. Then only you will be able to understand what the ancient sages are trying to tell us. So similarly, if you are on this journey, one thing you also need is a GPS mm -hmm. to know where is the next turn coming. So therefore, the GPS in the Vedic tradition was the Jyotish or the astrology. And it was primarily focused on mainly with respect to a woman and man relationship and wealth and profession and health. Because these are major consideration when it comes to how it can impact your peace of mind. So many people have experienced that their life turning upside down because the, the partner with whom they connected was not just compatible and they just can't uh, experience a, a similar kind of mental state. When people uh, are extremely stressed due to not having means to live, lack of wealth, poverty or sudden collapse, it affects their mind. If the health collapses, it affects the mind. So therefore, Jyotish kind of helps you in one sense make certain choices which can minimize these damages. But again, it comes with a disclaimer that the purpose is not simply to remain here. Right? The purpose is not just to find your way to the airport. 
सो ज्योतिष हेल्प्स यू फाइंड द क्लोजेस्ट एंड द फास्टेस्ट रूट टू द एयरपोर्ट एंड द एयरपोर्ट इज द मोमेंट ऑफ डेथ बट देन यू नीड स्पिरिचुअल नॉलेज टू नो विच फ्लाइट टू कैच बिकॉज इफ यू जस्ट गेट फैसिनेटेड बाई दिस होल जर्नी यू विल सिंपली बी गोइंग राउंड एंड राउंड द एयरपोर्ट बट नॉट मेक इट टू द फ्लाइट सो देर फॉर ज्योतिष नीड्स टू बी टेकन विथ अ सर्टन यू नो काइंड ऑफ अ डिस्क्लेमर दैट इन एंड ऑफ इट सेल्फ देर इज नॉट मच ऑफ अ डिफरेंस बिटवीन एन एस्ट्रोलॉजिकल एडवाइस एंड अ लाइफ कोच एडवाइस and a business coach advice because they are all giving advice on how you can increase your prosperity in this life and minimize your adversity in this life but they are all talking about till death only that's how we need to couple it with spiritual knowledge so that then we can reach did you ever read your own chart i have not uh, read systematically or something in a very deep way but the advantage is there are so many people who are so interested in telling me <laughs> <laughs> that without having to read my own chart people keep coming and telling me and you know they like to keep me as a case study and they'll suddenly start hey i think you must be like this this is your birth date so this is like this this is like that <laughs> but what is there in your chart like in terms of this monkhood oriented life was this predestined well you know i have never ventured and asked anybody or analyzed that but to be honest uh, i do uh, have many astrologer friends and i do have a lot of uh, friends who are astrologers who are experts in understanding the energies of space so i do i have utilized Uh, some of their services with respect to clearing energies in certain spaces with the kind of uh, skill they have so because you know as organization we have properties and various places and each place comes with its background and you know baggage of history of what used to happen in those places and all all that has an impact on the energy in a particular place so vastu shastra so vastu is kind of little different because vastu only helps you understand how the different uh, spaces which you have designed currently how it's impacting you but it doesn't tell you anything about the past of that particular land so this kind of astrological knowledge is kind of taking an x-ray of that particular dharti or that particular land and you know there are all these traditions and very systematic scriptures where these are experts in and they kind of do it but again i would say that you know although those verses may be in sanskrit and the geeta and bhagavatam is in sanskrit but we can call these astrologers as the life coaches the traditional life coaches whereas we still are the monks who are more focused on the spiritual knowledge on the journey beyond it So TRS Clips has all sorts of videos and all sorts of playlists. Make sure you explore the channel by subscribing and heading to our homepage and reading through all the playlists. Happens through curiosity.